Um. King Four. Hmm. This scent well, thank is you. familiar to I me. hope so as but well. In order to recognize it, I must combine my associations into one picture. Oh, really? This kind of puzzle? There's these little puzzles that you have to do. Oh. Okay. I see what you're. But this moves. Oh. Oh, funny. <laughs> Like, funny character does not even begin to describe what we feel like. Um. So basically, we're trying to figure out where... I'm trying to make this one picture, is what I'm trying to do. So, it all depends on the angle at which you look at the picture. Does that make sense? Little touchy, but it can be done. Huh. Yeah, Woo -woo. With a strong aroma, a hint of peppermint. Peppermint, huh? Interesting. Ricardo, I wouldn't you already have know that. the name of this man, Holmes. You amaze me. No, Watson, I refer to the cigar. It is a Ricardo Turrent. A Mexican cigar of an excellent quality. Quite an expensive one, too. Bitch, it's one of the guys that took the train! Ah! We're so good at this, it's scary. Um, ooh, Ash. Oh, it looks like Hal has started another bank heist, guys. If you're interested. And, cigar stubs. and a piece of paper. I see it. On it. Those something whines. They think they can snatch the future of the company from under our nose. Apparently, we must not something. There was a conflict between I don't... the Mexicans and the Chileans. Hey, whiz kid! You just advanced to dangerous idea level one. Congratulations! Yay! <laughs> it's just a little extra thing that we have around here. Ash and cigar stubs. Yeah, we got that already. Okay. Ash and me. A greenish brown cigar with a strong aroma, a hint of peppermint. peppermint. We know these ashes and cigar stubs are similar to the one that we found on the floor. Some of the stubs were recently smoked. There are others that appear fairly old. Hmm. I wonder how long the they were hanging around. Judging by his clothes, he's hardly a traveler or a tramp. Well concluded, my dear fellow. A man who hey, thank you for the follow, guys. I really appreciate it. Cigar spent several long days at Doncaster Station. All right. I'd say we're getting pretty dang close, guys. Pretty dang close. So I guess go talk to that dude about his cigar, wherever it is here. You're going to the Humane Society? That's cool. Are you guys going to... Oh, you're going to adopt a dog? Do you have any idea what kind of dog you want? I adopted this dude right here. He's been with me for like four years now. They make the great, greatest, awesomest dogs ever. Your dog died last November? I'm sorry, Tennessee. New horse racing magazines. Horse racing. Hurdle, steeplechase, and flat racing. Horse. He is a true enthusiast, Holmes. So the guy likes horse racing. Oh, that's still okay. Yeah, that's still horse racing. Probably a purebreed border collie. <laughs> Did you know my dog's a border collie mix? They're really smart. Really smart, and they have lots of energy. But I love him to death. A telegraph. Yes, everybody has a telegraph. We. Where did this dude go? Holmes, look. There's a flooded area over here. Hmm. I believe that the flooded area... And there's a thingy. Checking. There's a thingy right there. I saw it. Let's hear the sound of, like, the frogs. What? Are we supposed to, like, go in? No? Okay. <laughs> mm.
Mm Get it. They're not like... Over 2,000? Holy cow! Lucky, lucky. Would like to check it out, but I can't. <laughs> I hope there's stairs, because I don't know how to get back up there. Oh, hi, honey. It's fine, it's not. This is Toby, for those of you that don't remember. I uh, rescued a cat last March, and the last time that I streamed, she was really scared and would not come up to see anybody, and now, totally Good different thing. You, sir. My name is Sherlock Holmes, and this is Dr. John Although Watson. she scares the dog. We are investigating the case of the vanished train. Is that so? Well, good day, gentlemen. I am Mr. Duff, the station <laughs> master of this station. I'll be happy to help you in any way I can, but there's not much that I can tell you about last night. Tell me anything about last night. All right, let's do our deduction thing and figure out his whole life story and... life story and no no watch are you sure you're the actual person because I'm pretty sure the station master would always have a watch and a ring mark you are a shady shady fellow oh whoops I just did that that was my bad flooded area it appears that you may be at risk of some flooding along the line here you mean that the whole bloody lake is at our feet? Quite so. But it is strange, because according to my map, there should be a quarry here, and behind that, the lake. How should I know? I only arrived <laughs> here a few months ago. And Well, that's true. He could be married that? or divorced. Well, I was working in Nottingham. But I asked for a quieter place, so they transferred me here. Life is cheaper. I can't really complain. Cat will give me ideas. I think the cat went to go eat. <laughs> Did any passengers leave or board the train last night? No. I saw no one as usual. I reported the train's passage by telegraph. <laughs> Just the same as all the other nights. Lie, there's a dude here. There was a gentleman of Mexican origin, I believe, in the waiting room. Did you notice him? What? A Mexican? Here in the back of beyond? Are you quite sure about that? Yeah, pretty Goodbye, sure. Goodbye, sir. It is obvious that we cannot inspect the quarry. Instead, we can check the beach area around the flooded lake. Jet, welcome back. Ooh, I can- nope. I was like, yes, I can go this way! Just kidding. All lies. This place is, like, bigger than... In here? Okay, Hal, well, thanks for hanging out. Um, I will upload this to my YouTube, so you can always catch up um, later. But I totally understand. I got up super early this morning. Sleep is a precious, precious thing. So, if it... There. I'm... Yeah, no kidding. 
it's on map? Oh, that's a good idea, Wiz. Uh, let me check. Oh, it is! Oh, Wiz, you're a genius! Genius! Thank you. <laughs> and I was like, go check the beach. And I was like, I'm trying! I can't get there. <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right. Well, it looks like this case is going a little quicker than the last one. I wonder if it's because we kind of have a feel for the game now. Here we are at the beach that is located near the quarry <laughs> and Doncaster Station. It doesn't look like a very good place to rest. Hey, I see giant tracks of something. Check out this beach. I know, laugh it up, laugh it up. Tell Taz, she'll probably laugh too. People been staying here? This place was abandoned fairly recently. Yeah, I'd say. Hmm. Oh, pal, you're the sole survivor again. Observing oh. the coastline and the moored boats, we are able to see that the lake's water level dropped. The lake has flooded the quarry. The dam was probably breached. Good night, Hal. Hopefully I'll see you on Thursday. Couple days. to go so secret checked over I'm there always wondering what's on your mind Holmes you'll follow me on Twitter cool thanks Hal Way to like get over there or something. Won't miss any streams. Okay, cool. Cause it's saying it wants me to use this super whatever deduction eyesight stuff. Ah! Oh my gosh, we have so many tasks right now. What the heck is happening? Okay, Tennessee, I'll see you later. Thanks for stopping by. Examine the side railway branch that leads to the quarry at the station located between Chester Field. Sideway there. Examine the Doncaster Railway Station for suspicious to kill. Inspect the beach area around the Oh, for sure, man. I'll be back on um, Thursday, hopefully. And next week for me is spring break, so I will have no school. So I'm hoping to get some extra streams in there. Alright, I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking at. Oh, it's no big deal, Jet. They've just got stuff to do, man. I completely understand. I won't be able to stay on here forever. Oh, am I missing something? Well, I don't know. See, and that's... Oh, there we go. Play metal label. Whoa, 